And you can start this weekend off with some live entertainment. Make it even better tonight. Rock the Barn kicking off in Clarence. It's helping out people in need. 7 Eyewitness News reporter Rachel Alzafon is out there right now. She's live in Clarence with the latest. Yeah, that's right, Laura. You can see we've got the hay out, the tractor out. There's tents up all around behind me. We are ready to go for Rock the Barn. And joining me to talk about that is Noel, one of the co-founders of this awesome event. Uh, like Laura said, it helps Meals on Wheels, a wonderful cause. But there's also a lot of fun here. We know there's music, but there's a lot of other things to do here as well. Yes, there are. In fact, it's something for the whole family. You can bring your kids here. We have a kids activity tent that goes both days until 9 p.m. And we've got activities for them and we've done murals in the past and there's crafts and things that they can do it while mom and dad relax and enjoy the music scene a little bit. We've also got great festival food here so bring your appetite. Don't stop and get dinner beforehand. Come on out and have barbecue or we've got cozy cafe and catering. We've got Gianna Mazzias is going to be here. Clarence Grill. There's so many more that we could talk about. And we of course want to talk the music because that's the big draw for people and the big headline is tonight I believe. Yes, we have 10,000 maniacs tonight. We're so excited to have them back. They played here in 2010. They really rocked the barn and this year is going to be even bigger and better than ever. They've got their new album out, Twice Told Tales. There's a lot of enthusiasm and excitement about the group and we've just been getting a phenomenal advance response from them. And how many people usually come here? Generally over the two day event we'll have three or four thousand people. Nice. And it's exciting. It's a great time. There's a, a, a lot of old Clarence alumni will come, and we've got an alumni tent for them. And it's a place where everybody can meet and connect and, and have summertime fun again. Noel, thank you so much. And of course, like we were talking about earlier, the big reason behind all of this is to raise money for Meals on Wheels in Western New York, specifically the Clarence Newstead Akron site. We're going to talk more on that in the next half hour. Live in Clarence, Rachel Elzefan, 7 Eyewitness News.